first thing you want to do is weigh out your sands. We recommend using 25 pounds of this pool sand and then 25 pounds of a 30 grit medium grade sand. You can use other grit sands, just keep in mind that your sand loading will change a little bit. For example, right here we're going to put in the 30 grit sand, but if you change to a 50, 60, or 70 grit sand, you just wouldn't be able to add in quite as much sand into your mix. We're taking out a little of this 30 grit sand to get our weight spot on. Now that we have our sands all weighed out, we're ready to start the mix. The first thing you want to do is grab the liquid stabilizer, pour half of it in the bucket, give it a good shake, and then go ahead and pour the other half in. Now you want to add in 16 ounces of water per kit, and adding in the water will help the mix flow better and will also help it get a lot stronger. It is very important to remember this step. Your ideal temperature to mix everything up is at 60 degrees for the liquid and 60 degrees for the sand. Um, right here we're at about 70 degrees, which is fine as well, we just will have a little bit less working time. If you're starting out with material that's been in the sun or is a bit over 80 degrees, your working time just might not be where you want it. After you have your water and your liquid, you're ready to put your cement in and mix those two together. Scrape your edges to ensure that everything gets mixed properly. Go ahead and mix your sands in. Only dump in about half of the bucket, mix it, and then pour in the rest. Now it's time to add in your desired pigment. In this case, we just want kind of a concrete gray look, so we're just adding in a little bit of black. You can achieve any color by simply adding in your pigment of choice. Make sure that you get it all mixed in thoroughly by going all the way down to the bottom and all the way around your edges. Give your mix about a 5 minute sweat in time and this will just make the material more fluid and easier to work with. And just whip it up one more time before you pour it. <laughs> 